Excuse me. Yo, are you avoiding me? Uh, not anymore? What's going on? I just, I haven't wanted to talk to anybody. I'm not anybody and I would like to talk to someone. But you've been talking to everyone. No. Everyone's been talking to me. There's a difference. What do you want to talk for anyway? You don't care about what happened. How can you say that? You've been treating it like, oh well, another stupid day. The guy died, Daria. I know he died. I'm sorry he died. But I'm not going to pretend like he's some great guy because he wasn't. People aren't upset because Tommy Sherman died. They're upset because they're going to die. That's understandable. Okay, but you know what I've been hearing? I knew you would understand, Daria. You're always gloomy. I knew I could talk to you, Daria. You're always unhappy. Tragedy hits the school and everyone thinks of me. The popular guy dies and now I'm popular because I'm the misery chick. But I'm not miserable. I'm just not like them. It really makes you think. Funny. Thanks a lot. No. That's why they want to talk to you. When they say, you're always unhappy, Daria. What they mean is, you think, Daria. I can tell because you don't smile. Now this guy died, and it's making me think. And it's hurting my little head and making me stop smile. So tell me how you cope with thinking all the time, Daria, until I can get back to my normal vegetable state. Okay, so why have you been avoiding me? Because I've been trying not to think about the way we were making jokes about the guy dying and then boom, it happened. We didn't have anything to do with the guy dying. It was a freak accident. Yeah, well, I don't like when I make jokes about people dying, and then they do. I don't want that kind of responsibility. At least not until I have a job in middle management. You didn't make the guy die. And you're not the misery chick. <laughs>